hello and welcome back to mrs always right kitchen so we're going to have a very wonderful evening today so today another weekend i'm off this evening so i am at home so i'm going to start cooking so this is mrs always right kitchen and welcome back to this african kitchen we're going to say a very big thank you to all our viewers all our subscribers so you can see me <laughs> my turn pot stick is ready to be used so welcome back to our kitchen so you could see african kitchen the background is there and everything is ready to be cooked so today i'm just going to cook a typical coconut rice which is from nigerian dishes nigerian menu so that is a very interesting and very yummy yummy coconut rice so i've got ingredients so first of all welcome back to my channel my name is mrs always right also known as Mrs. Miller or Ima Bong or Patience. I've got so many names according to the meaning and why I've got so many names. So one day I'll do a video why I've got so many names. So you can see I've been doing shopping today. You know what Saturday means for girls, for ladies. Shopping, shopping, shopping. So thank you God first for everything and all the wonderful work in this channel and also thank you to all my subscribers so we're getting to 13,000 subscribers so far so I'm also grateful for everybody who tune in to watch this channel despite all the drama and all those things I've been doing which is not really what everybody expected but I just have to do it so now I'm in the kitchen coconut rice so first of all the ingredients I've got so far so I've steamed and boiled this rice this is rice yeah white rice and I've got mackerel fish which I put it in the oven oven roasted mackerel fish so it's really strong and some my neighbors are complaining that they could smell fish around so you could see how strong it is and i've got coconut milk which i have already done so you could see so remember i'm cooking coconut rice so this rice here yeah, when you cook it in nigeria the first thing that is attracted to this the smell of coconut is cats so once you start breaking coconut and the, any cat around will come and start crying meow 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 because they love coconuts so once you hear they hear the sound or the smell of coconut they will be looking for where this coconut is cooked because it's got so much strong aroma and you know the benefit of coconut in your hair your skin and that the digestive system it helps with anti-inflammatory pains and also with arthritis so many good uh, something from coconut and coconut oil any any type of coconut coconut drink there's so many things you know some people go and got it from the top of the palm coconut palm tree yeah coconut tree so when you go up there sometimes when people are fainting in africa or allergies what we have to do first is to give them coconut water and once they drink it it give it's like anti histamine to the body as well and if you got so much headaches as well and you drink coconut water direct from the top of palm coconut tree and it's helpful so there's so many things we do with coconut oil anything coconut some people use it in a, there's something they call gari when you want to sip gari you can use it as well there's so many things about coconut so now i'm going to turn on my 
cooker on the hob is on now so the first thing you're going to do sometimes you have to mix everything together then you steam it you cannot stir this coconut pot because once you stir it too long it's going to stick and it's going to be burnt before you even finish cooking it so first of all what i'm going to do is i'm going to add the coconut milk in the rice so you can see it so this is how it is you got to put it here coconut milk is added and then you mix it up remember the rice is already cook half done so with coconut milk he's going to cook it more so cheers i'm just having a bit of drink ice drink yeah so this is it when you finish that one another ingredient to add would be onions so onions is always available for me when i'm cooking so i have to add onions and i will add i'm just going to make this video short because i don't have enough of something in my phone so i'm trying to get myself a big something to help me with my videos because sometimes Though I got a very strong phone for the video, but it does always run out of storage. So, so now I've added maggi and onions and coconut milk. So I'm going to add this delicious, well roasted mackerel fish. So you could see, yummy, yummy. So it's all done. So I'm going to add that one. So this is how you can mix mix up coconut rice while it's not on the fire because once you mix it up you then you cook it slowly very slow cooking and low heat on it so what i'm going to add will be my chili 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 so i love hot chili so this chili it made of hot chili peppers and and chili corn you know the hot chili from africa so it's all mixed with so it's going to be a bit colorful as well so it's going to so i've added, I've added chili so this is how it is all you have to stir it up so you could see it's all mixed up together so I'm just going to use cook it slowly and in low heat and I'll come back for you to see. So this is so you have to cover it now and just cook it for another five minutes. So thank you for watching and I will come back again at the end of the cooking. So let's have a bit of jumping around while we are cooking so we're going to do a bit of keep fit while we are cooking so that we have to lose a bit of calories and then when we eat we won't have too much
I'm just done with it. Hip hop, hip, hip hop, hip. <laughs> so, exercise while you are cooking. This is what we should be doing in the kitchen. You do a bit of exercise, and then when you eat, you won't have too much. <laughs> Thank you for watching and I'll get you posted at the end of this cooking and have a lovely day. Thank you. Bye-bye.